Hey what's up guys, this is JRTV Gen and welcome to our new episode, um, let's play Street Fighter Cross Tekken. I just got it like yesterday and I've just been messing around on it, I've done a few trials, I've completed like Ryu's, Ogre's, um, Bison. And I'm gonna go through the fundamentals because I personally didn't like look at anything to do with Street Fighter Cross Tekken, I just waited until it's released. I didn't want any like particular spoilers you see so I've been experimenting and the characters that I've sort of used and I think are really fluid in like you know light moves linking wise I would definitely say Able, um, Poison, uh, I'd say Relento but he's a bit I don't know it's a bit weird the timing on the uh, standing light punch to the crouching medium kick because that's generally his normal combo but I just have to get used to that, but I've been messing around with some of the characters, mainly the Street Fighter because I'm not too confident with the Tekken, and I would definitely say at this moment in time my favourites are Zangief, Guile, Bison, Yoshi Mitsu, bro, yeah, and I would like to play as Jin, but I don't I haven't played him enough to actually get used to his combos. And yeah, I would pretty much say that that's it. Oh yeah, an ogre. Ogre is beast. Look how awesome he looks. But yeah. Um I'll just pick a few characters. Let's see. I got these special editions, so I had like, you know, um, extra gems and stuff, but we don't really care about that. I haven't played online yet, so I'm not, I'm not very good at this game, just so you know. I'm just here to experiment with combos and such. Um, to be honest, there aren't that many stages, but then again, each stage becomes a second stage, <laughs> if that makes sense. But I definitely prefer the half pipe stage. This is the unlikely uh, duo that I would have never thought I'd pick Guile and Yoshimitsu as like perhaps my main team. But they're just really sweet. And as you can see, I've got inputs at the side so you can see what I'm doing. Um, okay. Right, okay. Um, let me explain from the beginning. In Street Fighter Cross Tekken, there are, well, basically just a combo, um, light, medium, heavy, and then a launcher, like, as if off Marvel vs. Capcom, but as you, use, as you use the uh, launcher, it takes your partner in, as you can see, or you could just do a hard tag, which is like, two medium buttons, or you could just do a straight up launcher with the two heavies. And I've noticed that um, when you're using a light, medium, heavy combo, you can't do a, a normal special move, you know, like a normal Sonic, sonic Boom. So let me show you. You just can't do it. So, um, yeah, the only way to get past that is to do a EX move, but make sure you do not press the heavy ones, as I've found that it just sets off the launcher. Like, oops, wrong one. <laughs> Press the wrong button then. Sometimes it works, sometimes I accidentally hit the two launcher buttons. So it's such a ball eight. You should just use the light and medium punches for EX move. That's what I advise. And yeah, with Guile, it's changed so much. This is a completely new game. Although it may look the same, it really isn't. Like his, uh, this combo. That, that is like supposed to be a one frame link in Street Fighter 4, but you can do it with ease on here without plinking, which is pretty sweet. Majority of the combos, you don't really need to plink, and that's my favorite combo with Guile because it takes off so much damage. Let's see, I'll show you two comparisons, like one with, major with more moves in, sorry, and then one without. Featuring the super combo. So. Oh, wait. Okay. This is a corner combo, sorry. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. Right. 
to activate gems, you've got to, um, you know, fulfill certain conditions. So it's in all in the customization menu. So you'll find that out later. Oh yeah, forgot to mention, you can also tag while you do a special move. Or a normal move, I think. Yeah, you can. Okay, but I generally just, you know, tag during a special move and then you can link it on. If you can juggle or something. So yeah, this this would definitely be my uh, third time experimenting with... Well, I just sort of got like normal combos, you know, like... Uh, yeah, just messing around with normal combos with individual characters and then just trying to think about how they can, like, connect in their tag team moves. Because I've seen, like, Poonko and, uh, you know, Desk. They're just pulling off loads and loads of combos and I, I just couldn't get my head around it until I picked up the game. Well, I probably still can't, like, but... <laughs> I'll figure it out one day. But, yeah, I mean... Uh, you just gotta think about how many times you can juggle and what you can't do while they're in the air. So, can't really explain more than that. That's sort of an example of a tag combo, I guess. But I did two tags instead of one because I wanted Yoshimitsu back in. Uh, yeah. Super combos take up two bars. Raw tag and a launcher does not take any of your bar. Then there's a cross assault which takes up all of your bar and it uses like. You know, two ultras that switches your character out at the same time. Oh, wait. Okay. Thought I could juggle the light kick and then medium kick into the Shoryuken motion then. You can do it for Yoshimitsu. Oops. Yeah, if you press forward and medium kick with Yoshimitsu, it does the stupid. Yeah, that. <laughs> and it gets in the way of the. Uh, if you can't do a shortcut when you do the medium kick to the Shoryuken motion, so yeah. And also, every character is different with uh, you know the super combo that takes up two bars. But instead of like a double motion, you know, like a quarter circle forward, forward, and then a, uh, you know, all three punches or all three kicks, it's just one single motion. So for Yoshimitsu, it's forward, 180 backwards, and then all three punches. If I said that right. That's why it's so easy to get like a super link, I guess. You can also. Get it in a normal combo, but that doesn't do any damage. That's why I've sort of experimented with damage scaling and stuff, and like got Guile a decent half health combo. Apart from I messed that up. <laughs> there we go. Well, almost half health. If you have, you know, attack gems, then it'll boost up your damage. If you have the yellow gems, it'll be shield, I think, so it means that you take less damage for a certain amount of time. And the green is movement, and then you get like assist assist gems that sort of like make your input commands easier or something like that. I've not used them before, but because um, they sort of have like a disadvantage to them, they decrease your attack or whatever, an attribute of your character, so I don't think it's worth getting an easy assist one. Oh yeah, the training stage on this game is so sweet, look at it! I don't even mind being on it, like normally in training stages I just hate being on them. And the music's pretty sweet. Oh yeah, all, well, oh yeah, I forgot to mention, this is about links. 
being a Street Fighter 4 player, you're used to all the, uh, you know, like, one frame links and stuff. But, like, on here, you would think that there's just like a. You can do like a light, medium, heavy, whatever, can't you? And you can't link that into a normal special move. But then, obviously, because of Street Fighter 4 knowledge, this is where it comes in. You can actually like delay your punches and kicks and actually do the normal combos that you can do in Street Fighter. Wait, okay, so this is generally what I do with Bison. Apart from messed that up. Or if you're spy enough, I guess you could blink a super print it. I messed that up. That's the EX move. You definitely should not rush your combos, I think. Because otherwise it'll just go into that sequence and then you can't do a special move unless you use the EX. So. Oh yeah, I find that weird that you can link a medium kick into the slide. Look how slow it is though. I'm not used to that because Bison's is always punishable. One thing I just like to use with Ogre is just like his tag move. It's pretty sweet. Woo! Motherfucker. Yeah, I think I'd like to pick up Ogre and learn him properly, but I've literally played with him for like 15 minutes, I think. Just did his trials and then just pissed him out. I'm just wondering if I can add anything else onto there. So if I do that. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, sweet. So I can. <laughs> okay, that's just made my ogre combo so much better now. Let's start again. Try it without the gem. So yeah, um, two juggles I guess, or three. If I don't, can't even remember. With Ogre, he's got such a nice long reach on his leg. This is like the crouching forward that Ryu has. He can link it straight into a, uh, you know, cutscene move. I like that. Boom! <laughs> Get away from me, motherfucker. That's pretty much it for now. I mean, I'll be uploading some online matches later. I've currently got some university deadlines that I've got to do, so I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.